the chip and chase. This session is about chipping the ball over a flat defence who are coming up quickly. It's all about the players communicating between each other so the kicker and the chaser know what's going on. What we're looking for is for the kicker not to chip the ball too early, letting the defender come onto him as quickly as possible, and for the chaser to accelerate onto the ball. Okay, we look at the, uh, the chip and chase. Okay, Cordy, you've been uh, chipping the ball back and forward to Mike. What we want you to do now is to run up to this line and then chip it. Try and get the ball, imagine the ball going over the posts, over the crossbar of the posts and landing it on Mike. Okay, off we go. That's a good one. Excellent. Let's just have a look at how you're holding that ball then. Come here. When you drop it, if you can drop it at that sort of angle there, it should end up being able to go end over end. Okay, so don't drop it like that. Just drop it. That's good. Try not to uh, break the stride too much. Do a bit more pace coming into it. That's a good one. Alex, what we do is come up to this line and try and just block the chip. So start from there, just jog up to this line and try and just stop the chip. And we chip over so Mike can run onto it. Okay, off we go. Excellent, that's an excellent one. What we're going to do is just make this thing a little bit narrower. So, Gordon, if you just bring that to cone in there, leave that cone, Alex. Bring the cone in here. Okay, that's fine. Right, narrow area. Okay, you've got to beat him either with a pass or a chip, okay? So you can two-handed touch, you can intercept, you can knock the ball down, okay? So it's just a simple two-on-one. You can use the chip or you can use the pass, depends what he does. You could fake it. Off we go. That's fine.